Hello! Today I'm going to show you how to draw a soccer ball. First we will create this pattern. Let's make a new document. Go to File, New and type 1280 for the width and 720 for the height. Click OK. Select the Polygon tool. Click on the artboard and type 60 for the radius and 6 for the sides. Select the Rotate tool. Press Enter and type 30 for the angle. Click OK. Using the Selection tool, let's move this polygon to the top left corner of the artboard. Select the top left corner of the polygon and holding the ALT key on your keyboard, move it to the right until it snaps. Press CTRL D 10 times. Let's make another row below. Holding the ALT key on your keyboard, copy and paste the polygon down below. Make another copy to the right. Then press CTRL D 9 times. Let's fill every other polygon with black. Select the polygon and change the fill color to black. And repeat. Select all. Click on the top left corner and holding the ALT key on your keyboard, move it down until it snaps. Press CTRL D two times. Select the bottom row and press delete on your keyboard. Press CTRL zero to see the whole page. Using this pattern, we will create a new symbol. Go to Window and select Symbols. Open the Symbols panel. Select All and click on the new symbol icon. Name it whatever you like and click OK. Our new symbol is now in the symbol panel. We won't need this pattern anymore, so go ahead and delete it. Now we will draw our soccer ball. Select the ellipse tool, click in the center of the artboard and holding the shift and the alt key on your keyboard, draw a circle. Change the fill color to none. Press Ctrl C on your keyboard and Ctrl F to paste in front. Let's create a new layer. Click on the little blue square next to layer 1 and move it up to layer 2. Turn off the visibility of layer 1 and lock it. Go to the Direct Selection tool and select the anchor point on the left. Press Delete. Select the top and the bottom anchor points. Go to Pathfinder and select Unite. Go to Effect, 3D and choose Revolve. Change the position to Front and check the Preview box. Then select the Map Art and choose the Surface 5 of 5. Go to Symbol and find the symbol we've created before. Make sure the Invisible Geometry box is checked. Holding the Shift key on your keyboard, stretch the symbol so it will fit nicely over the light area. Click OK. 
go to object and choose expand appearance let's select the red line and press delete on your keyboard now we will use the circle we've created at the beginning turn on the visibility of layer 1 unlock it and move it above layer 2 thanks for watching bye bye